Earth's second moon, an asteroid called Kamoalewa, appears to have come from the moon itself. Scientists have concluded this using computer models, revealing its origin as the Giordano Bruno crater on the moon's far side. Near-Earth asteroids, of which the Kamoalewa is one, are generally thought to have come from the main asteroid belt between Mars and Jupiter's orbits. Kamoalewa, also called 2016 HO3 and meaning, oscillating celestial object, in Hawaiian, is about 130 to 330 feet, 40 to 100 meters, across, about the size of the Statue of Liberty. It was discovered in 2016 by Pan Stars, an array of telescopes in Hawaii designed to find and track Nice. About 250,000 Nice are currently known. Kamoalewa is a quasi-satellite of Earth because it appears to orbit Earth despite actually orbiting the Sun. It moves in sync with Earth in a one-to-one -one resonance. The asteroid comes from Giordano Bruno crater on the far side of the Moon, according to a paper published this week in Nature Astronomy. A 14-mile-wide, 22-kilometer, Giordano Bruno crater is thought to be the youngest crater of its size or larger on the Moon's surface. The researchers say it was caused by an asteroid about one mile, 1.6 kilometers, in diameter striking the Moon between 1 million and 10 million years ago. The researchers used numerical simulations to model the kind of impact that could produce and eject something the size of Kamoalewa. The project involved weeks of computation on supercomputers to explore every possibility, according to science. This is not the first time the Moon has been suggested as the source of Kamoalewa. In 2021, a team of University of Arizona astronomers using Arizona's Large Binocular Telescope Observatory suggested that Kamoalewa could be a chunk of the Moon. That was based on the fact that its spectrum, the light it was reflecting, was unlike that of any other NEA. Last year another research team agreed after discovering that although unlikely, Fragments of the Moon caused by an impact in the past few million years could find their way into orbits like that of Kamoalewa. Although the Moon is covered in craters, each caused by asteroids or meteorites, the lunar material ejected by the impact generally falls back to the lunar surface. Scientists will soon know more about Earth's second Moon, Tianwen-2, China's first asteroid sampling mission will visit Kamoalewa next year. It will be the first mission to study an asteroid tens of meters in size, the most common yet least understood small body. Kamoalewa is expected to orbit in the vicinity of Earth for millions of years. Giordano Bruno crater is on the Moon's far side, often mistakenly called its dark side. Despite it being a term used in popular culture, the dark side of the Moon has no technical meaning. The Moon is tidally locked to Earth, so we only see one side of it, the near side.